Hello. Can you tell us a bit more about yourself and your art practice? Okay. My name is Maria Ovczarek and uh, I'm artist based in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. I'm originally from Poland and art, I can say, was always my passion. I have really three uh, fields of interest. This first number one is art, because as a small children, I like to draw and paint a lot and uh, Everybody appreciate this. I feel fun. I have a feeling that I'm doing this better than people uh, at my age. And uh, I was thinking that this can be my field when I was small children. And I was planning, uh, like I, when I was 10 years old, I start practice to prepare my portfolio. It was just, it was just plan. <laughs> But uh, another my interest is uh, psychology and special social psychology. I am less interested in clinical psychology, most in understanding how human uh, perform in social settings. And uh, um, also in health, psychology of health, uh, psychology of well-being, uh, another my interest is religion. I have also degree in theology. I have a master in theology, in Catholic theology, with specialization family theology. And I have PhD in social psychology. Uh, but I am painting all my life and uh, I try to be accepted to art uh, uh, the faculty in universities and I was not successful in beginning, but I never give up. And finally, recently, few years ago in 2018, I try again in University of Alberta in Edmonton. I was accepted and I graduate this year with distinction and uh, immediately started to put some effort to continue this to grow more uh, because after after graduation what i see i i was able to develop some techniques but uh, this is big journey to really became artist to create my own style it's a lot of work and i found then residency is fantastic place to grow. I can say then I never, in, during my university study, I never feel so much freedom to create and so much, I never have so much inspiration to grow, to, to develop something what I really want, because in university is too much ready assignment to just do this, learn this, this way exactly. But here first time I have time and support, because time I always have, but it's difficult to be alone. And here I have company and support from people like you to grow and uh, develop my style to trying something really what I want to do as a artist. Um, because it's take a lot of time during my life uh, when I, before my education, I try different things in, uh, I always like uh, painting landscapes. My mother was very good person and always she, she when we was in the walk, she always uh, pointing something, look, this is beautiful and this is beautiful. And she just inspired me when I was children to look at beauty around and especially in the nature. Uh, but after, because of my interest of religion and spirituality, mystical experiences, I start being interested in religious painting because I like church. I am all, I was always looking in art in the church, but I was also fast, started to be fascinating in 
not from my tra Roman Catholic tradition, but from Orthodox tradition in icons, because it was so much colors and these gold leaves and shining. And uh, like for me, it was something uh, which showing more this mystical, mystical part of spirituality. General Orthodoxy, Christianity is more mystical than a Catholic. And this is why I was interested in this art and I started learning this. I learned from artists from Russia when I was in Montreal and uh, I participate in his classes and learn very traditional techniques. He was very strict to, I have to be like this exactly. <laughs> he, lear he learned this in monastery in Russia. He also bring to us original pigment from Russia, from this monastery. It was fantastic experience. And uh, now, but now, because I finished my last uh, years of uh, training during uh, restriction connected to so-called pandemic. And uh, I decided to then uh, maybe now is a good opportunity to show something from this time, to paint something what can be maybe historical document of this time. Then one of the role of artists is to illustrate this what going on not only in the nature but also in politics in uh, social life and this is my goal now uh, this is what I want to do as an art in this residency is to create art connected to this. I start make sketches, uh, collecting uh, documents uh, to this as my, uh, as resources, as documentation. I maybe can create, can also make a movie. Uh, come to when I take together these documents, and this can be good way to preparation of this. I uh, like also Renaissance art, and maybe I can take this, uh, create something together, uh, create port portraits as uh, of heroes of present time, but make this uh, like old Renaissance part portrait with little bit of landscape in the background. And in this um, land landscape can be action connected to activity of this person, but also add uh, something from icon, like some shining elements, glitter, or mm, something what can show my feeling about heroes of this time, uh, appreciation, appreciation and rank of this, uh, of these people, like holiness of these people for dedication for the society. I am still working uh, to find the right way to express this and making sketches, but uh, this is general idea in, in this moment. What uh, can be developed, uh, it can show during painting, probably. Okay, uh, your project will be about heroes, that's the theme. And you mentioned in a way it's going to be ongoing project. Besides that project, what are your future plans after the residency? Any other project or exhibition or something in your mind already? Yes, I'm thinking then if I can create enough art like this and can be uh, no more than one uh, portrait, I it's new next and next people coming to my mind, not only from US, but uh, uh, not uh, in Canada. I want to start from uh, Canadian heroes, but I want uh, also add uh, people from other countries which coming to my mind. And uh, after this can be good to to just create exhibition maybe i can 
uh, have to wait a longer time before this exhibition, before time can be more peaceful. When uh, Picasso painted Guernica, he, in the uh, beginning he was not able to show this in his country. It seemed to take time because before it was possible to show it, and sometimes this art uh, may wait for the right place and right time in this moment. I will share with my friends in the beginning and continue working. It can be longer work. Well, the right time will come soon for sure. Thank you, Maria, for the interview and everything. Thank you.